This is your DNA Info Evening Update for Monday, January 11th. Flurries in the forecast tonight, dropping to the mid-20s. For Tuesday, breezy and cold with highs in the mid-30s. In your neighborhood headlines, a Bronx man is facing an attempted murder charge after police said he shot at his ex-girlfriend late Saturday night with a handgun purchased hours earlier. Prosecutors said Ramon Lalandres Castillo had a history of domestic violence against the woman. In the West Village, Left Bank Books has found a new lease on life, but not on West 4th Street. The independent bookstore will move a few blocks away to a cheaper lease on 8th Avenue as it attempts to hold off a tough economy and the rise of digital books. First it was cigarettes, then trans fats and sugary drinks. Now it's salt. The city's health department is encouraging restaurants and makers of packaged food to voluntarily reduce salt by 25% over the next five years. The city says high blood pressure causes 23,000 preventable deaths each year. And the city's librarians are reading the fine print on their contracts today. The New York Times reported if library temperatures fall below 68 or rise above 90, the unionized workers are allowed to take the day off. A library spokeswoman didn't think anyone had used the excuse yet this winter. Those are your headlines. Get all your Manhattan local news at dnainfo.com.